Convince somebody to actually tune in and follow Zero Call. Well, I think that um, it, it, you know, in Singapore, you don't really, it's a kind of hyper real version yeah. of Singapore. You don't get a lot of guns and gunfights and shootouts and, and you don't see the underbelly. So, in a way, it kind of reveals a little bit of the, the violent streak in all of us. Mm. But it's also, um, you know, in, in the show, there are a lot of people who take the law into their own hands. So that's why that explains all the action sequences. Right. Um, it's kind of thrilling. Wow. I, I think it's uh, just a, a good a good night out. Can <laughs> hang out on TV and watch some blood, gore, and violence? Why not? Well, take dinner at the same time. Yeah. yeah. At the same time, isn't it? Right. And you see all the girls doing it. What happens is you never know who's really on the good side or the bad side. You don't even know if Pierre's character is on the good side or ah, the bad. Side. Okay. okay. Um, and that's kind of fun because you're always kind of switching, yeah. switching from one to the other. This is rough, tough Interpol Asian. Yeah. Let's see how hard she can spin the wheel. Wow, that, that's a, a rough, tough spin. <laughs> and it lands in Australia. All right. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, thanks for spinning the wheel with us. Thank you.